What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome back to my subscribers and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. It's a free general click of reading for all signs. Cups to decide to everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, it apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate. Leave the rest. Free general collective reading for all signs. Love and appreciate each and every one of you guys. If you'd like to donate, it's High Priestess Tarot 5. The link's in the search box below. PayPal only, no cash app, no cash app, no Venmo. It's a very private, confidential way to donate if you choose to donate. Love and appreciate each and every one of you guys. Um, if you uh, like my content or feel free to share it, please feel free to share it via social media, uh, word of mouth. I very much appreciate it. Love you guys. Okay, so I received another channeling, so I'm here. These are psychic, intuitive, prophetic messages. One may apply, two may apply, two plus may apply. Only you know your specific story and situation, not anybody else. You have to plug it in how it resonates. And also, um, all the readings for July are up. All of them are, are caps to side, everybody in between, even bonus readings for all signs and all the channel messages. So you can go back and view them for July if you would like. For the new, newbies you're joining or anybody, uh, if you my rider dies, they've been here for two and a half years. Um, but they're all up for July, every single one of them, okay? Um, and... Um, the new, my newest channel, hashtag glow up with the exclamation point, all caps. Um, there is two readings posted on that channel as well. Thanks everybody for all the love and support to that channel as well. I appreciate that. Um, and feel free to share that channel as well if you would like. Love and appreciate the support. Single mom and two kids. Just saying, just saying, just saying. Uh, everybody think of me on my, uh, my child custody battle. Um, tentative court hearing date coming up. Tentatively, Monday, 725 of 2022. That's my birthday. I'll be 39, for anybody who doesn't know. And my son's birthday is tomorrow. He'll be 15. Um, we're currently in the McClendon standard. So um, it's tentatively Monday. And um, if everybody can keep in your thoughts, prayers, well wishes, and good graces, I very much appreciate it. Love you guys so much. Um, this is not my first rodeo with him. Just to let everybody know, it's not my first one. It's actually more like court case five, six, or seven. Um, with him. I've explained a little bit of the history with him on other videos if you want to go and check that check that out. Um, but it's not the first rodeo with him. So it is what it is. I'll just go in there and tell the truth. And I'm not an unfit parent. I don't do drugs. I don't drink. I don't sleep around. I don't party. I don't club. I'm well, I do good with my finances. I uh, kept a house over a roof over our head, owning this home for five years. So I mean, there's no unfit, unstable parent red flags here. So, I mean, it is what it is. I'll just go in there and tell the truth. Okay. So, the channel message I received was, um, excuse me, sorry. The channel message I received was, um, through many series of chain events, a lawyer is about to um, reach out to someone soon. A lawyer's office. I heard a lawyer's office is about to reach out to someone soon. Um, they they um, know about someone's um, a case that someone could really, really win in a huge way. And um, they're going to offer their services pro bono to this person. They know this person has been held back and held back and held back and held back. It's going to create many positive series of chain events for this lawyer's um, lawyer team and for the person. So you plug it in how it resonates. That's beautiful. Pro bono lawyer energy. I've never pulled that in, but I am today. So you plug it in how it resonates. Someone else is getting a huge wake up call. Someone else is getting a huge wake up call. Um, you plug it in how it resonates. I've never pulled in pro bono lawyer energy. For anybody who doesn't know, there's private lawyers, public defender lawyers. Um, you know, your right to a lawyer, right to counsel, whether it's public defender or private lawyer. Um, for anybody who doesn't know. And pro bono means the lawyers, it sounds like a group of lawyers, um, or maybe two lawyers on in this group. I mean, I don't know. I heard lawyers. Um Pro bono means they're going to do it for free. So they're going to take on your case for free if this resonates for you. Um, you're a feminine energy. You're a femme energy. That's what I heard. You're a femme energy. So you're a femme energy. And the lawyer's office or lawyer's group or 
two or two plus lawyers either know about your case or your history or something to where they know that they could basically take your case and win it for you. Um, or they're about to find out about it. How that resonates. And you are feminine energy. If this resonates for you, ma'am. I feel maybe the lawyer, lawyer or lawyers group watches my channel or they're about to come across my channel, maybe through a shared video or videos. Or the feminine energy watches my channel or she's about to come across it through shared video or videos. How that resonates, ma'am, um, and lawyers group. But kudos to the lawyers group for doing this because, um, you know, lawyers are, their services are invaluable. Well, if it's a good lawyer and good lawyers group with not crap lawyer advice and, you know, um, where it doesn't, you spend all this money and then nothing ever positive ever comes out of the shit. Um, but good legal advice and good lawyers, they're expensive. They're usually expensive and it's hard to come across. Um, and I mean, not, well, yeah, it can be hard to come across. It really all depends. Um, it really all depends on who you get, whether you get a crap lawyer, crap legal advice, or good lawyer and good legal advice. Uh, but whoever these lawyers are, they know they can win the case. They either know about the history of UFEM energy um, and the situation or situations, or they're about to learn about it. It sounds like they know they can win it, um, either from evidence that's already in the universe, or they have, or somebody has, or you have, or something. And they're going to offer their service or services free. Um, free to you. Pro bono means free. That's beautiful. That's beautiful. Whoever you are, Fem Energy. Um, that's really beautiful. And somebody else is getting a huge wake-up call. Serum messages here have reflected. I'm going to pull some tea leaves. This lawyer's group is in deep regret because in the past they know you were telling the truth. Okay, I heard um, this lawyer's group is in deep regret because they know you were telling the truth in the past. Staff, you will be taken care of in difficult times. So maybe you consulted with this lawyer's group in the past is what I'm feeling, Fem Energy. Or you attempted to consult with this uh, them, um, this lawyer's group in the past, or you know somebody um, that consulted with this lawyer's group. I feel you probably tried to consult with them, or you did. Um, but um, I heard they're in deep regret because they know you were telling the truth in the past. So somehow they know you were telling the truth in the past. Maybe they didn't reach out and help you, or they could have helped you and they didn't. How that resonate? May, I'm feeling you might have had a consultation with them or attempted to have a consultation with them. How that resonates. It's at least two lawyers in this lawyer group. I heard lawyer group. And whoever you are, I don't think this is like if you're in current legal issues, I don't think it's your current lawyer or lawyers. If you are in legal issues, current legal issues, or a past lawyer of yours. I feel this is somebody you like haven't really experienced legal action from is what I'm feeling. Um, like their legal services, like their legal um, counsel and things like that. Carriage, a journey, either physical or mental. We have February and staff will be taken care of in difficult times. I just heard pull one more. This is going to be wonderful for you and this lawyer's group. A huge ass case. This is going to be, going to be wonderful for you and this lawyer's group. Um, a huge ass case is what I heard. Okay.
So we have staff you'll be taken care of in difficult times, February, carriage, the journey, your physical or mental, fox, shrewdness and resourcefulness, especially in business, angel, spiritual guidance, protection from harm. Staff, you'll be taken care of in difficult times. Your family did not want you to be successful, but through many series of chain of events, you're about to be in many ways. And your and your neighborhood, your na uh, city. Okay. Your neighborhood, your city, and your family did not want you to be successful, but through many series of chain of events, I heard you're about to be. So your your neighborhood, your family, and your city didn't want you to be successful. Well, shit, Fem Energy, you must be the GOAT if you had a freaking neighborhood, a family, and um, the city didn't want you to be successful. And that's just the truth. What happened to you was very uncalled for, and through many series of chain of events, someone is about to really step up. Someone you would have never expected. Okay. Heard what happened to you was very unnecessary and very uncalled for, and through many series of chain of events, someone you would have never expected is about to step up. So you will be taken care of in difficult times. I think it's this person you would have never expected to step up is about to step up. I think it's the lawyer or lawyer's group that's about to do this case for you pro bono free basically i mean lawyers fees are very expensive trust me i know i've been in a lot of legal issues my ex-husband and that's just the truth february wonderful things were supposed to come to you by february of 2022 and they have not because your crazy ass family and others in your city have been blocking you, but through many series of chain of events, the energy is about to completely shift. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. So I heard many wonderful things were supposed to come to you by February of 2022. So we're in July. So people have been purposely keeping you stuck and stagnant for strategic reasons. I heard your um, city and your crazy, I heard crazy ass family. So, your family, they don't want you to be famous. They don't want you to be successful. They don't want you to be in the limelight. Um, it is about to backfire on them. And it's about to happen for you, and they are going to be nowhere around. And, okay, so it's about to backfire on them. So, your family didn't want you in the limelight, but it's about to happen for you whether they want it to or not. It sounds like you're about to be in the limelight in a positive way. Regardless of whether your city wants you in the limelight or your crazy ass family. I heard you were supposed to be successful, supposed to be moving on, supposed to be in a good space basically by February 2022. So about five months ago. But it didn't happen because of your city that created negative series of chain of events for you and people in your city, I'm presuming, and your crazy ass family. But the energy is about to shift and they're about your family's about to be left out, and I'm assuming your city too. Because you're about to move on. I think you're about to connect with a lawyer or lawyer's group outside your city. That's what I think. Or they're about to connect with you. I think they're about to connect with you. Because I heard they're, um, they're going to um, offer to do it free of charge. Pro bono. Which is wonderful. Carriage, a journey, either physical or mental. You will have to travel for this. But it will be very, very, very worth it. You tried to travel in the past to get help. Okay. Um, I heard you will have to travel for this, but it will be very, very, very worth it. I heard you traveled in the past to try to get help. Um, so um, you try to get help in the past, and it sounds like you traveled a far distance, um, a far journey physically to get help. I think for some, you were bullied or targeted or gang stalked. Or something in your city or community. And I think your family had a lot to do with it. Um, and I think this lawyer or lawyer's group knows this. Or they're about to find this out. Um, it could be this lawyer's group that you traveled a long distance in the past to try to get help from. Um, but maybe they didn't know the whole story. Or they're just learning of the story or what have you, what have you. But 
um, or it could be a different lawyer's group, but how that resonate? You traveled a long distance in the past. It sounds like outside your city, outside your province, outside your town, etc., to try to get help. I think you were bar bullied or targeted or harassed or gang stalked or something, but nobody helped you. You were not able to get assistance. So they just kept bullying, harassing, targeting, gang stalking. They just th thought it was funny to pick on your ass. But you can't do that. You can't do that in a free world. You, I mean, you can't do that. You shouldn't do that. That's just morally unethical. And that's just the truth. But I, when I, uh, these pro bono lawyer or lawyers group, I think they're outside your, um, I think they're outside your town, province, or city. Because I heard you're going to have to travel. But it would be very worth it. So a journey, either physically or mentally, is physically in this aspect. Physical traveling, I think, to meet with a lawyer or lawyer's group. Um, and um, discuss this or what have you, what have you. That's what I feel. Fox, shrewdness and resourcefulness, especially in business. Them putting themselves out will, it, they will, it will be expensive legal fees here. They will be out expensive legal fees, but it will be really, really worth it in the end. Really worth it. Okay, I heard them putting themselves out will be, uh, um, it basically, their legal, their legal expertise and their legal counsel and their legal services are going to be very expensive. But I heard they're going to do it pro bono, meaning they're going to do it free. So they're going to go down. I mean, not go down, but they're going to lose money taking on your case because they're going to do it free. But I heard it'd be worth it on both parties in the end. Very, very, very worth it. But it'll be worth it on both parties in the end. Very, very, very worth it. So in this aspect, the shrewdness and resourcefulness, especially business, is them doing this pro bono, basically. They're going to take a loss financially because they're not going to get money from you to do this. Um, because they're going to offer their services for free to you. Um, because it's something that happened in the past. Uh, but I heard it's going to be worth it in the end for them and you. So I think they're going to get publicity from this because they know they can win it. And I think you're going to get publicity from this because um, it's going to be one. The lawyers know they can win it. And so they're not going to get the consultation fee. They're not going to get the lawyer charges. They're not going to get blase, blase, blase legal fees from you, but they know they can win it. Well, that's awesome. I mean, but it, but you're helping them because I think their firm is going to, it's going to go very, very public. I think they might connect with the local news in their city or province or area when this case is won. And it's going to make their firm have way more business. So even though they're going to not take on money from your case, it's going to be worth it in the end for them and their business because it's about to go up in a huge ass way after they win your case. Because people are going to see the story of you and your case. And it's going to make them look like good guys in on news if they decide to collaborate with the news to make it public. Which, that would be smart as hell to do. And that's just the truth. That's smart business right there. Another lawyer is getting a huge ass wake up call. Huge. Another lawyer is getting a huge ass wake up call. Huge. I mean, I mean it. That's just the truth. And it's like, as above, so below. What goes around comes around. Yeah, they're going to take a loss in the legal sector. Taking your case on for free. But in the end, their business is going to freaking skyrocket because of the severity or complexity or nature of your case. I think it's a huge-ass case. And I heard they know they can win it. They know they can't. Angel, spiritual guidance, protection from harm. Someone in this lawyer's group has been getting, receiving heavy, heavy, heavy downloads. Heavy downloads to do this. 
And through many series of chain of events, someone from this lawyer's group may reach out to you very soon. Someone in this lawyer's group has been giving, getting heavy, heavy, heavy downloads to reach out to you. Um, and I heard through many shocking series of chain of events, they probably will, someone from this lawyer's group will probably reach out to you soon. So someone in this lawyer's group, they receive spiritual downloads, just like I did from the spiritual universe. Like these are clear audience spiritual downloads. Now, whether they publicize out into the world of 3D that they receive downloads, probably not because they're a lawyer and they make good ass money and they don't, you know, whatever, whatever. Like I'm an RN, but I do this on the side um, back when I'm not getting wrongfully terminated four times in my city, just saying. But, um, but I don't, what I'm saying is when I'm gainfully employed, like I was doing both of this for a hot ass minute. I was working full time at a long-term care facility and I was doing this on the side, making money as a hobby on here, two income streams for a while. But when I went to the hospital in January, I got wrongfully terminated. I was still getting two income streams off of here and there. But what I'm saying is I don't think this lawyer lawyer that receives spiritual downloads in this lawyer's group, I don't think they get on YouTube and download their um, downloads to their collective like I do. That's what I'm saying. They make hella bank. Whoever this is, this is a this isn't um, some crap legal advice. This is a really high-end lawyer's group. I think like a high-end lawyer's firm. And I'm serious. This is a really high-end lawyer's firm. I'm really feeling it. I didn't hear that. I'm just intuitively feeling this. I'm feeling um, 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 heavy hitter energy. I'm feeling heavy hitter energy. Heavy hitter energy. And I'm just being for real. But they get downloads. They're not going to tell you they get downloads, but if you're highly intuitive enough, you'll be able to figure it out when you meet with them. And that's just the truth. If anybody needs to hear that. Okay. Let me see if I hear anything else. All right, I didn't. All right, I love you guys so much. A water sign is getting a huge ass wake up call. Huge. A water sign is getting a huge ass wake up call. Huge. So, a water sign is getting a huge ass wake up call. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. You can have Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio in your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North, Moon, Midheaven, Jupiter charts. Water sign is getting a huge ass wake up call. You plug it in how it resonates. Love you guys. Everybody have a good day. Namaste.